Hello Virgo and uh, welcome back. Tonight we'll be looking at the energies that will be uh, around you and we're talking about March of 2021. So Virgo, let's start. Hmm. Wonderful. Already the chariot, okay. So, I have to tell you, Rico, that uh, from uh, the previous December until uh, next May, two months from now, has, uh, from December, has already started um, a period that you will be having a lifetime chance, a huge chance to renew yourself, renew your life your work, your home, and look again back into your inner self and um, heal any kind of wounds you'll be having, any kind of traumas that you'll be having, find it back with your own self and feeling very good. This is a wonderful chance and you should not miss this chance for God. You will also feel um, very relieved and uh, many situations that uh, had been like a problem to, to you will start finding solutions, okay? And um, things will turn being very positive for you and you will be having great results in no matter what you are doing so that will make you feel again worry-free. Big chances are coming. You just have to be there, you know, as I always say. Look at the chances, see them, have, keep your eyes open so to see them and then embrace them when they come to you. But you have to notice them. They are coming to you though this, this month. You will start absolutely have the feeling that uh, life is getting happy again for you. During the second part of uh, the month, during the last two weeks, you are starting, uh, this has start, already started, but it will be much more intense during the second part of the month that uh, you will think what you want from the relationships that uh, with people that you're having around you right now and uh, most of you will have an intense, intense desire to start cutting off people from your life, okay? Um, especially the people that are toxic, especially the people that don't serve you and your higher goals anymore. Uh, my advice is that you could be a little bit patient and not burn bridges completely this month, this period, these two weeks, okay? Not yet. Uh, also, you may have proposals from abroad. Uh, could be love, could be uh, cooperation, money, something like this. And um, also, at the same time, you have to calm down, okay? You have to calm down. There is a person that uh, <laughs> would make you fall in love again, you know, and it's coming the second part of the month. Or it is around you, but you will feel this feeling that, yes, I am opening my heart again and I'm loving again. That person, though, it's not any kind of person. That person is, uh, has a presence, has personality, is a significant person, is not just anyone random, okay? Oh. And I think that we are almost ready to start your tarot reading. Hmm. Next month also, we'll be very focused on relationships. You have to know this, very focused on relationships. And I have to tell you from now, 
already that uh, April will be even better for your pocket, your money. Much better, even better. March is very good, very good month. April for your finances is even better. Okay, let's see. When I say about uh, first weeks, first two weeks, second two weeks, okay, the, the energy is, uh, is, is not cutting pieces, okay? is lingering and uh, certainly uh, when I say that a person will make you open up your heart again and make uh, and uh, fall in love again maybe it's already in your life and you have start feeling it but during that period you will be sure that uh, you have put all your cards down and you're ready to open again your heart and love the full new beginning for you Virgo about uh, something that you had been waiting for especially about money and Virgo already just fuck already the ace of wands already the ace of wands <laughs> the six 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 for Virgo it is about time to enjoy your law your life hmm? absolutely so let's see Virgo transformation ending and transformation at the center of your reading fast fast you are determined to change your life didn't we say in the in the beginning that you have a huge chance to renew yourself this month ending transformation determination you are very determined to change everything around you Virgo let's see your focus options Virgo is having options that's so normal your past Offering love to someone. Your strength. Uh -huh. We will see the hangman. The future. Ooh. Let's see the energy that's around you. And you don't know. This is. The, that's it. It's a, no, it's not the energy that you don't know. It's around you right now. The energy that you don't know is this one. Page of Swords. Hoping for love, Virgo, hoping for love, your soulmate. And again, High Priestess. <laughs> you had the Ace of Wands before, and now in all or over and around and during March, there is only one uh, quality that will stand out. The Queen of Wands. You are the Queen of Wands. You are the fucking sexy Virgo right now so let's start the clarification and see as we said here you are determined to change your life to start over and renew yourself it, uh, it ended yes 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 Oof. what you didn't have in the past you know what you didn't have in the past the three of ones from the past that you wanted to have, it's at your future. Look, the seven of, uh, of cups, the options about love is at your focus. Death and transformation is the center of your reading. And it was, uh, you had started something uh, in the past that was your uh, hope coming true, dream coming true, hope fulfilled and whatever, the star. Even though you had been um, having maybe options, because you're a person giving love, lots of love. But you understood in the way that um, what you have been thinking that, oh, with that person or with that relationship, with that uh, job, business, I can do so many things in my life and make all my dreams come true. You understood at some point that what you had been dreaming of actually was uh, where illusions and uh, you just stopped it emotionally energetically you stopped it i don't know if physically you have uh, left a situation i don't i don't see it right now but uh, we'll see later if it plays out with another card but right now i think that you have understood that uh, the dreams turn to illusions and you are being in a phase of transformation starting already from the past with death and uh, continues this month. Let's see here the um, Seven of Cups. 
For some of you there, I feel that you know that you have options, but you are a little bit unfaithful. You are not believing in it 100%. Maybe you can say, you know, you realize that there are people, there are situations, there is love around you, there is money around you, but you say, mm, no, could it happen to me? I don't think so. But at the same time, you are focused on this. But you have to believe it, Virgo. Uh, if you want to manifest such a thing in your life, such change, okay, you should not start by saying, um, yes, I can do it, but maybe it's difficult, maybe it could not work. No. Uh, you are fucked everything. You have fucked everything if you are thinking like this, right? No, don't even do it. No, no reason to manifest like this. If you want to change your life, you have to think and say, yes, I will change and yes, it will happen. Otherwise, no, 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 it will not work. It will not work. So you know that you have options in your life. You already know that you have options in your life. But um, as we said, you don't really believe it inside you. You don't really believe it inside you. You have to change it. And uh, when you change it, Love is coming. At the same time though, one of your options is your past. To start opening, uh, looking at the horizon in front of you, opening your wings and heading to the future, you are focused to leave a situation from your past. Could be a person, could be family, could be work, could be anything that had problems in your life, okay? That situation from the past had problems and uh, you are leaving the problems behind. You are moving towards love and this is one of your options, but again, I repeat, if you want this to happen, believe in it. Don't say, oh yes, I know that I have options, but who will now do this with me and that and it's difficult? No, Virgo. Okay? No. Don't do it. Here, the hangman. Because it just will not work. If you want to work, you have to believe it. There is an energy that is coming from uh, from the past. Okay. Oh, wow, wow, wow. <laughs> Virgo, what's going on? What? What do you have in your mind? You are the queen of wands with uh, the ace of wands in your mind. It's your strength, the sex appeal, uh, the energy that from one side Virgo is taking no fucking bullshit anymore. Mm? No, you are very logical, you're very rational, uh, you are thinking um, what to do, how to do and uh, your focus, your strength is this combination, the, uh, the, your mind, your logic, plus your good heart, your uh, um, character of giving love to people and to be affectionate to people. At the same time, I see you that you are enjoying a lot of uh, luxuries. You want a better life for you. You want um, luxuries in life from small until big luxuries in life. Okay. And um, you also have your lust. You have lust, you have style, you have elegance, you have care, you have uh, for other people, you have love to give to other people. At the same time, you accept no bullshit. And um, this, this uh, change, death, death two times, this change for the new Virgo, thinking like this, has already started. It is not brand new beginning, no. Has already started this transformation. At the same time, you know that if it needs for you to stand still and say, okay, I have to think, I have to plan with my logic, as I said, okay, with my, uh, my sex appeal and everything, but also with my logic. So if I need to have this balance between those two energies, so to plan for my future and be successful, I will do it. And you use it this as uh, your strength. You're not rushing into making mistakes. No, you are 
very practical right now and uh, you are um, calculating your next uh, step in your life as, as we said the chance to uh, renew even your home your work your inner self hmm? you have plans you have plans for something big Virgo let's see here this one cannot be your past this work this card ah. The Queen of Wands, the Ace of Wands came two times. Now we have the Knight of Wands with the Devil, super fucking super sex. What the f and happiness? This is your happiness of the future. You will be very happy no matter what. You will be very happy, and you are waiting at least this happiness. Sometimes, uh, because you are waiting and waiting, and you are saying, When the fuck is going to happen in my life? when it's going to happen i really need this i really need this now to come and i feel it but it's not coming i want it it's not coming i'm manifesting it it's not coming and this puts you into your mind and into your head all the time overthinking and overthinking and overthinking very cool break this cycle break this chain okay somehow get out of this uh, mind state because it will come to you even just thinking and thinking and thinking all the time and all the time and all the time, what are you going to to win? Nothing. Okay? And I assure you that the things that you are waiting, one part of it is also attached to a lot of money and to a lot of sex. You will tell me, no, how can it be? I will say to you, yes. If you don't want, you don't believe me, but you appear like the Queen of Wands with the Ace of Wands two, time, two times and the, um, the Knight of Wands. Okay, if some of you were talking about excessive sex that you want all the time or someone else wants sex all the time from you and it feels like it is toxic, okay, could be, could be. Uh, each one is different, right? How much it can take? But you had been waiting about this. Hmm? You had been waiting about this. Very sexy Virgo. Success. No matter what. Two of ones. Success. Let's see the success card. Oh, okay. Very good. Do you know what? Successfully. Successfully. You are... Hmm, Virgo. You will find out something. You will find out something that will break your heart, probably, about the cheating, and you will overcome it so fast. It is like uh, tried to touch you, and it didn't. It could not even touch you because you're moving away from this energy here. Cheating, three of swords, like uh, heartbreak, chariot. You are moving away from this you are moving fast very fast out of this energy and you are going to your success just like you say i don't give a fuck even if i have news about this i don't give a shit i don't care why because i'm very good with a queen of wands as the queen of wands you know who can beat you uh i mean virgo look you are the queen of wands the sexy virgo we saw uh, the Knight of Wands, the two times, the Ace of Wands, but at the same time, you are taking no bullshit, as we said before, as your strength, as your strength, okay? This is how you are. Right now, during March, you will be the fucking sexy Virgo. But at the same time, you will be using your logic. You will not let other people manipulate you, okay? And uh, at the same time, you are the stylist, the nurturing, uh, the wonderful Virgo that has style, elegance, and is very lustful. So, because you're very lustful, and you have this energy of that sexy queen, it is normal that here at the future we're talking about excessive sex. It, uh, devil plays out so often, you know, to, to your reading, so often. This is important, we have to think about this. And for me, devil is lots of money, lots of sex. Yes, can be toxicity. Yes, can be fears. Yes, can be insecurities. Codependency. Yes, but codependency here with what? With what? Waiting could be what? attached to waiting. Could be. The bad thing is that 
the only thing is that you should not be attached to this energy okay you should not be attached to this overthinking and thinking and thinking all the time because you are unstoppable and go for all or nothing and if you go for all or nothing without rushing but if you plan and go for all or nothing you will have the success let's see the news that uh, come to you high priestess here two times oh fuck do you want something new in your life oh very cool look okay the ace of swords has the energy that you don't know new beginning the ace of pentacles new beginning with money clarity okay very good uh, start with great 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 uh, chances for the future and the happiness for the future the new beginning here about money mm -hmm. the new two two aces the full new beginning in your life I could not say that there are three different beginnings no it could be one beginning but has uh, different sides could be uh, very successful and we're talking about money and then could boost your life for it take a new path and everything will start with some news that you don't know yet that you will have maybe you're feeling inside you that yes yes they are coming I'm waiting for them maybe you will keep them as a secret and we will see because here we also have the uh, high priestess what is the potential outcome is here also the energy that you don't know and the energy that you don't know is two fucking uh, uh, aces the ace of swords the ace of pentacles and the fool certainly we're talking about a new beginning very good in your life you appear like the queen of wands lovers you want love oh, la, fuck. you don't see this every day you go Look what is happening here now. What the fuck? Look what has happened here, Virgo. Here we see the uh, Six of Pentacles, okay? Uh, they call give and take. You could also have from here uh, money. Could also be a uh, court. Could also be some uh, uh, money. Look, look here what is going on. Look the news that is the energy that you don't know yet and it is for a brand fucking wonderful new start in your life appears as your hope oh. so you are actually hoping what you don't know that is coming to you you are hoping about something you just don't know that is coming to you what you're hoping about this yes new beginning about uh, uh, happiness new beginning in your life new beginning uh, with money but but very cool the news that you're hoping that they are coming to you you're hoping about this but they are coming to you and you don't know okay and apart from the new starts we're talking about lovers with the lovers two times the lovers you know it's coming to you this is really significant really significant if we're talking about contract could be contract could be two contracts i don't know what uh, but it will not be about two people coming in your life two lovers no it is just uh, boosted energy this is coming out to say to you that yes what you're hoping to be your uh, life partner what is hoping to be uh, yes, maybe even about work uh, the contract that will be forever and ever you know, that you have been hoping for years could be But I think that here we're talking about Your soulmate your other half your twin flame your whatever you want uh, The lovers with the lovers And that ten of cups the ten of cups 
happily ever after, forever and ever, with my soulmate that I cannot miss. There is no chance that you can miss it from in your life. You cannot, this, this energy cannot pass like this. It would be crazy if you tell me something, ah, oh, it didn't come, how the fuck cannot come? You cannot miss such energy, okay? Just be there, open your eyes. We're talking about something long term that you are hoping for to have with a person in your life or that person to come in your life. And it's coming at the energy that you don't know and you will start something wonderful with that person, wonderful with that person. And money will come to you, new beginning will come to you, a new stage in your life will come to you. You, I feel like uh, you cannot even expect what is coming for you, you know? You manifesting it, as we said before in the beginning, right? You are manifesting and maybe you are saying like, oh, maybe, I don't know, could be not. Don't play games. This is big thing coming to you. Big thing, Virgo. Very big, very big. And you appear so balanced, so fucking balanced. Three queens, it's not an empress. Three queens, the qualities of three queens are for you. The future is, wow, okay, very sexual future. But what I am amazed is that here, right now, you're very strong and you don't give a fuck about uh, some kind of cheating, some kind of heartache around you, if you have news about this, if you learn about this. But here you'll have an awakening. Here you will have an awakening, Virgo. Oh, I like the... Fuck, I like it so much, you know. Such a brilliant energy. I can feel the energy is brilliant, you know. I'm shocked that uh, you go this way and say, oh, I want this to happen. Maybe sometimes you don't really believe it, but if you do it right, you are hoping about all this. You are hoping about all this fucking beauty. And uh, wonderful is that what you have been hoping for is coming to you and open new horizons to you in your life and you just don't know yet that your hopes are coming true. And we're not talking about only one card, gets one card, we're talking about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cards. Not only one to, to confirm that new beginning in your life. Two times lovers, two times lovers with ten of cups. And let's see here the High Priestess. <laughs> Just said before, it's not three, uh, three queens. Let's see the Empress. Here is the Empress. Yes, yes, yes. I know, I know, I know, I know. I know Virgo, I know very well. Uh, you get imbalanced because sometimes you say, what? I am waiting to become that Empress. I'm waiting to become, to have everything in my life that I really want, I really need. You know, of course, that it's coming. You know that it's coming. You know. Maybe you keep it a secret. Maybe you will keep it a secret, or maybe it is. Um, it has kept because here is the high priestess at this energy. Here, the outcome is. Uh, could also be if you want. Do you want baby? You can have a baby. Do you want? Could also be the high priestess. It's not the sun, but anyway, okay. Um, still here. You cannot decide. You are very balanced and you had been waiting for a long time, you know, for a long time to have uh, the Empress be the Empress, Virgo, and it's coming to you. And you know it inside you that it will happen, you know. Your intuition is telling you, yes, yes. Balance yourself, Virgo. Here's balance, balance your Virgo. And what you are waiting for with the Three of Wands to be the unstoppable, to have everything that you want in your life. Uh, Virgo, and this energy of nothing can stop me is coming to you. One more fucking great reading for you. Okay. Easy life. Easy life. You have to uh watch out i don't know why it's like to be a little bit clumsy but uh i don't know which card could be here clumsy 
you have to know. New life and easy life for you is coming, Virgo. Trust me. New life and easy life is coming to you. So thank you so much for watching. And until uh, next time, I wish you all the best. All the best. I'm so glad once again about this beautiful reading. And until next time, take care of yourselves. And bye for now.